What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into royalty and tears after supporters claim they are lying on CJ So Cool, Corey and Danny Dunn, Queen Mom. Now, I already reacted to royalty, but <clears throat> uh, we probably just going to get into the rest of the video, depending on how long I can deal with what royalty talking about. So if you guys have been keeping up with my videos, then you know that there's a lot going on right now with the situation between CJ royalty and Jalea. now if you guys aren't sure what i'm talking about please check out my previous videos on this topic but now royalty has officially spoke out to social media confirming that the allegations are true now she felt compelled to come to social media and release a statement because a lot of people weren't believing them the people behind closed doors she denied everything she denied these allegations that were put upon him because, yes, of course, she was 10. She doesn't know what's going on. She doesn't know. She barely even knows right from wrong. She's so <clears throat> when I reacted to her video, first of all, I'm going to do the comments today. I just want to say. In order for you to get a point across or in order for you to like. Put a story out. You got to put that story out, okay? Now, I ain't going to lie, I probably would have been better off speaking to Jalea because remember, this did not happen to royalty, allegedly anyway. It happened to Jalea, allegedly. So her mom coming up to speak for her, uh, I just don't feel like was a, a, a good job. I feel like management should have um, made a different decision on how this was brought out. Um, y'all got to understand that in the event of this happening, this is a tragedy, obviously, but y'all also got to understand without proof, especially as a hood journalist, I can't just be out here saying CJ did it. I can't. And I'm not about to ridicule Jalea either. You know what I'm saying? Um, especially being the fact that she's not a full adult yet. Cause she about 17 or 18. She, she definitely not uh, an adult, but I'm saying she's not 10 now. So um, I'm not saying she's lying. I'm not saying Royalty's lying. I'm not saying CJ's lying. I'm simply saying that uh, Royalty could have did a better job with what she did yesterday. She's a developing girl. She doesn't know anything. Yes, yeah, she denied it. She was scared. She was bribed. She was threatened. I'm going to keep it moving. Now, CJ is also catching hell from bandman Kevo. Now, Kevo went onto his platform to do a little exposing himself because now, see, he's stating that everything that they're saying about CJ is true and that he's done this in the past. He'll say stuff about stuff. And it's like, bro, I really know you. I really know you know you. It ain't like you just talking from a distance. I know a whole lot about you, like, Plenty of times where we had to make little prostitutes say, hey, man, can you go to the hospital and get rid of the baby and little shit like that. Like, then nigga, millions and millions of girls' inboxes, the youngest girls, like, all types of shit. So that's what I look at it like, bro. Just leave. Don't mention my name. Trust me, bro. Like, I really I am a troller. I will troll your life away all day. You will want yourself playing with me, bro. Like... You feel me? Like, I will get on my podcast every day and literally talk about your ass all day. And bring girls on the show. I'll get real dirty and bring them girls that you mess with, them young girls, on the show. You know what I mean? And give them a platform and all that. So leave me alone, gang. Or never say nothing about me, ever. Do y'all know how old Bam Man Kevo is? I forgot he did that 6 8 surgery shit. He was born in 1990. Okay. Type shit. There were rumors going around that Danny and Corey had broken up. Wait, he was born in 1990, which would mean he's 34. How old is Diamond? Diamond got to be 25. Y'all know I'm never on CJ's side. Ever. But 
after they unfollowed each other on Instagram. Now it appeared that maybe Danny had blocked Corey. So when I asked Corey if they were still together, Corey confirmed that those rumors were false. To the comments. Somebody said, look at, look at the tea, look at the tea room side nose, yeah. Ain't nothing happy with Danny. I just got man, see, let me tell y'all something. Y'all be so invested into this social media, it's kind of weird. We be at work. We be at work. We only at work. When you do it, you at work. When we do it, we at work. They kill me like trying to flip it like y'all invested. We're at work. <laughs> when I get off this app, I'm talking none of this matters. I got other shit to do. But when I'm at work, I'm at work. When y'all get off work, y'all job don't matter either. Bitch, I don't know. <laughs> Here to a certain stink. Did that just a test it? Just take a name out the bio and take this out. Uh, everybody think that we broke up. Bruh, my girl is like literally working. You know what I'm saying? I just got the phone with her just then. Did it the she just pranked me, y'all. That girl gonna send me, that girl Danny go, I tell y'all where. See, I will go show y'all, but I can't show y'all because I ain't screenshot it. Bro, the girl gonna send me a pregnancy test, bro. The girl sent me a pregnancy test, bro. And the bitch say positive. I looked at, I was in the, I walked in the studio, I walked in the restaurant. I checked my phone, I looked, I said, what the fuck is this? <laughs> we say, hey, we say, we say, Twins said, Oh, she just took a COVID test. That bitch, back, that bitch came back positive. <laughs> that bitch had a whole pregnancy test. I call her phone, I'm like, what is this? So now it does appear that they had some issues, but they worked everything out and they are back together. Now, some people were assuming maybe this was because Corey's ex, Molly, changed her profile picture to an old picture of Yo, Corey what? and stated, my BD harder than a lot of you ninjas. Some people <laughs> in her comment section were saying things like, I'm crying. He finna go on a rant now. Molly responds with, no, he ain't. And I told him I was finna do that. Then someone states, don't let him see this. Molly responds with, he know already. It seems like Corey may still be in contact with his ex, Molly. Corey ain't let Molly go. <coughs> Molly water. Corey ain't letting that go. You know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Um, Y'all, some things, if I don't talk about it or I don't address it, I'm just not. That's all I got. Uh, so that's all I got. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Yeah. Hey. Before I go, y'all make sure y'all tap into my Patreon. I got everything you want, you would like to watch over there. I got it. Okay. Just make sure y'all go over there. It's free to become a member, but to actually join and see the videos. Tap in, man. It's worth it. Okay.